Simon, frustrated? Yeah, I think so. I thought, look, we, we knew that a game today was going to be, could turn into be a frustrating day given how well they defend and the, the limited number of goals they've, they've conceded this year. Uh, and said the other day in my press that they've beat Sunderland, Peterborough, uh, Coventry, Drew with Oxford. And, and I thought we played well first half. I thought we, we, the system that we played and the movement that we had caused them quite a few problems. And you have to try and capitalise when you're on front, in front, should I say. Um, and we just needed to be a little bit uh, up at 5 10% and, and try and get that first goal. And then um, it didn't pan out as we wanted to do. And then it became a real frustrating afternoon. First things first, you've been to see the referee. What for? Well, he, 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 I wanted to see him about the penalty decision, obviously. He, uh, he says that Armand's punched the ball, which um, my answer to that would be, why would somebody deliberately punch the ball in his own 18-yard box? Armand's adamant that he's been pushed from behind. The referee said he didn't see that. Um, I asked him about why we not being given a penalty just before they got their penalty. And he just said that it wasn't hand to ball, it was more ball to hand. And, in this day and age, you won't have a clue when you look at decisions that are given for and against you when it comes to penalties hit, um, and handball situations. Um, and, one, and after that, obviously, it was a, it was a more frustrating afternoon because we, we didn't do enough to get back into it.